Good afternoon guys, it's Friday right now. So, this Friday is not gonna be another 48 hour day, which makes no sense to you guys, but it never ever makes sense to us either. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to go ham on that thumbs up button, hit that bell button, because it notifies you every single time we release brand new videos. And hit that subscribe button if you're not subscribed. Let's start today. On today's agenda, we need to get ready for the Adelaide pop-up, and it is my best friend Tom's wedding. Oh my God, it's crazy. Because I've been friends with him for like, uh, Nearly two decades, he went to jail for something and then he got out of jail <laughs> and now he's getting married and it's insane. Like, I, I can't believe today is the day that he gets married because he's been my childhood friend and um, it's really exciting. And I got my hair cut. And we still need to pack all of our stuff for Adelaide because it's tomorrow we fly out in less than 24 hours. 12 less than 12 hours. hours. Sure. We have to DJ, so it's the wedding, DJ, fly come back home to make in time for Saints Our Day. <laughs> it's gonna be a hectic, hectic next 48 hours or three days or whatever you guys wanna see. Um, I'll show you guys what we're doing and then how we pack and stuff like that. Uh, also, there is a promotion for the sneaker laundry. Tell them about that. Oh, uh, spend a dollar on our sneaker laundry in store or online and you receive a free box of sneaker wipes which look like this. And you get eight of them. Eight, yes, eight of them, which is pretty cool. All right, let's go. We are sorting out stuff right now for the Adelaide pop up. So we're only bringing X amount of stuff here. So 15 bum bags, five UPC bags, maybe like four or five of those tote bags, and then all Phillies female stuff, three balls, couple of dog balls, a whole bunch of masks because that's easy to take away, and a box full of lanyards and keychains, which is perfect. I gotta sort out these and then go through these as well and that. I am back home now, obviously, as you guys can tell, you guys know what a house looks like. But earlier we said we went to Werribee. I was meant to go because I needed to find an outfit for the wedding. However, I just could not find anything. It's really frustrating because the things that I like, it just didn't fit me. And the things that did fit me, I just didn't like. And I just didn't like the way that it looked in my body. And I was just like getting super frustrated. So. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just recycle one of the dresses I've already worn to a wedding. I have two to choose from, either just like this long sleeve kind of lace one or a type of strapless one. I'm not sure which one I wanna do, but I'll just kind of see how I go. I did buy a pair of shoes though. These shoes are from Famous Footwear. I did wanna kind of splurge and buy something from Tony Bianco yesterday when we were at High Point. But then I was just like, I never wear heels or anything anymore. So this is just going to be like a one-time wear. And I don't think spending like $200 on a pair of heels is really like for me. So I just got one from Famous for Wear. And these were like $40 or $50. And pretty good for one wear. They're also not really high, which is good. Because when I wear high heels, I end up being a little bit taller than how. And I don't really like being that much taller. So these are super short. But I like how it's got the two straps at the front. Those are kind of what I've been looking for. And these feel really, really comfortable. So I think I'm going to be able to last all night in them, which is great. I also got myself a couple of jewelry pieces, depending on which dress I wear. Because if I do wear the strapless one, I need like a necklace and some earrings. Whereas if I wear the long sleeve, like lace type of one, I don't really need anything that fancy or like to make it bling out. But if I do wear one of the dresses, I've got some gold earrings, three of these to choose from. And then I've got this necklace. I wore a necklace similar like this last time with the dress. I just lost the necklace. So I was like, you know what, let's just buy another one. It was like $14. And then I've also got this one here for me to choose from. I'll just definitely be wearing this in general, not just for the event. But I like this one, it's like got a circle right here and it's got like this dangly one plus this shorter one. I don't know if I will wear this shorter one, but I really like it. So these are my gold options with one of the dresses. I'm right now gonna go wash my face, get ready and all of that stuff because it's now like 5.30. So let's do that and I'll see you guys after I'm dressed and ready to go to the wedding. I ended up going to, oh my god, what the hell is wrong with this lighting? I ended up going to High Point um, after the warehouse with Jamie. I end, didn't get to go to the bank because the only bank that I needed to go to was closed. But I did end up picking up these Air Force Ones. Okay, I haven't bought a, a shoe for a while now. This is the Jester size 9s. These are so sick. Look at these. 
If you guys are like, why did you buy just normal Air Force Ones? No, I did not. If you guys can see it, it gives it like the off-white feel. Look, the tags down there. Everything is so cool about this. I just wanted a really clean white pair of sneakers and I finally got myself a pair. Anyway guys, gotta get ready to go to uh, the wedding. Yeah, I was gonna say funeral, but now I'm going to a wedding. One day, yes, oh, you guys didn't know. Oh, whoa, now I've said let it out bag. Uh, one of my really good friends passed away. Um, we went to his funeral yesterday and now today we're going to a wedding. It's how life works, doesn't it? Just before, oh, look, I got changed by the way. Just before we leave for Adelaide and the wedding, I got everything charging right now. Battery pack, FPOS receipts, FPOS machines, uh, GoPro, battery, uh, battery from my camera and the iPad. And are you ready to go, babe? I am ready. Do you want to talk about your outfit? I told them already, this is the dress that I'm reusing with the heels that I bought earlier today and my jewelry. Very, very simple. Hey, you do know we used to sell these, these, babe? You know I bought two of them. Why? By accident. Well, I had one, but I couldn't find it. And then this one's actually a bit longer. That's our so, one. No, I bought this. I bought both of them. They're both from La Vista. Oh, because remember we had stuff like oh, this? Oh, yeah, so true. This is not food, Biggie. You can't eat. You want this here? Eat it. These are all lucky envelopes. Yes, I have bait lucky envelopes because I'm such a hot beast like that. But look how crazy these are. Which ones do you guys reckon I should choose? But which one do you want to choose, babe? I like this one because that is super, super cool. Yep, okay, so I'm going to use the big ass pink one. So if you guys are wondering how I get this, it's because I spend so much ridiculous money at babe and they give me these cool little gifts. My one is the best. And how's one? Mine's, I got sicko bow. Obama. Are you excited? I'm excited. And the layer is really nice and cute. I like it a lot. So, like, these are First meal, it's like crab and something. All I know is crab. Crab and prawn. Or is it prawn? It looks like tofu. It honestly looks like tofu. I don't know what that is. Ah, oh, duck salad. Before I eat it all, we have um just sweet corn soup thing. Is that sweet peppercorn? Is it sweet corn soup? I have no idea. <laughs> I think it's shark fin soup. Yeah, I think it's shark fin soup. <laughs> Most definitely shark fin soup. Just finished uh, Tom's wedding and you guys don't understand, Philly took like the table ornaments home. <laughs> like 
Look at this. So pretty. It even comes with a vase and everything. <laughs> and we just literally took it home. It's like smelling in my car, like so nicely. But now it's time for me to go DJ at uh, 808. And then straight after 808, we need to go home. We need to pack and then get ready for Adelaide. <laughs> it's a crazy, crazy 24 hours. This is really struggling to. What are you doing, babe? You didn't even drink. It's I don't even know what you're doing. Okay, right let's way? go. Literally just got home. It is 3 of 40 a.m. in the morning. Um, our flight's at 6 o'clock at Tulla. So that means we need to leave in about, I don't know, like 20 minutes, 30 minutes. Need to pack and leave. Luckily, we're only staying one night overnight. So what I've learned is that I, I, I'm not going to rush or anything like that. Anything I do forget, I can just buy over there. And I don't want to waste my time just freaking worrying about this kind of things but the majority of things I need to bring is obviously camera, laptop, laptop charger, the F plus terminals um, and GoPro and portable charger that's pretty much it that's all I'm going to bring and a change of underwear so I'm just going to wear the same clothes that I wore last pop up I changed out of my suit and tie and and whatever so yeah I'm just going to go I'm dying I'm dying me and Philly were actually talking in the car. We were like, why do we do this to ourselves? Next time, we're just not DJing on Friday nights or we're just going to make the pop-ups on Sunday. But let's get to the airport ASAP. Right, we're at the airport trying to check in and now our bags are stuck. It's stuck right there. And it's all the machines are all, yeah, of, all of them. And she's like, just go to another one that's green. No, but this but one on the receipt. right here is stuck. No, but that one says it's checked in. So it's already checked in, um, that one. And we cannot use that. Yeah. Uh, 772 to Adelaide to proceed to get ground quickly in preparation for boarding. Thank you. Just landed in Adelaide, and Adelaide Airport was actually really cool. Like it, it's somewhere I've never been before, which is uh, surprisingly different. But if you guys notice, we're in the same rental car that we rented in uh, Sydney, so. Philly's gonna love this one. <laughs> I've been driving like a maniac back home in Melbourne just because I want a new fast car and this one's so fast. It's not so fast. It's, it's just faster zippy. than Swifty. <laughs> it's just zippy. Like zippy is different. It's got sports mode. <laughs> is this one on sports mode too? It's the same car, babe. Yeah. I literally just said it's the same yeah, but car. Yeah, I don't have sports mode. It is literally the same car. Okay, let's head off towards the CBD. Supposedly it's only 18 minutes away. We need to get fives, tens, and twenties. No, just fives and tens. Okay. But a good thing about this is there's always a cash exchange out of Westpac and NAB and a Commonwealth Bank. Ba -ba -da -da! That is the change that we need. We're starting off with $300. We have a couple of hours until the pop up actually starts. And setting up this place isn't going to be that long as seriously because one thing that we haven't told you is that our signs haven't come yet. Thank you. Lost in the mail at the moment. We're hoping it will arrive by yesterday because we've done express from Alex and it's just nowhere to be seen at all, which is super frustrating and annoying. But we're just here now getting a little bit of a tea, a coffee, and a croissant so we can get a little bit energized for the next few hours. My go to is always an English breakfast tea. How always has a latte. And this is always our easy like side pick if we don't know what to eat, which is just a ham and cheese toasted croissant as I just told you guys. Good morning 
everybody you guys have seen our journey here we are finally here at Fairfax Adelaide I'm so excited I'm so tired but I don't know if you guys can see behind me there's already a crazy line we're half an hour until doors open and I can just imagine it's gonna be insane today so if you guys are waiting in line thank you so much let's finish setting up and I hope you guys enjoy this video if you guys enjoy this video don't forget to give it a big thumbs up let's start the day it is literally less than 20 minutes until we open, but check out this cocaine Fairfax uh, collab tier. This thing is actually on fire. I, I, um, me and Eddie created this and I was like, we need to use the new logo because this new logo is flames. This is just an uh, exclusive tier here. There's only 50 of them. Um, Sorry guys, if you guys miss out and you guys want this, but we're super excited. There's a lot of people outside, as you guys saw before. We're ready to roll. And um, zero sleep, right? 